Hi, I'm Jennifer Slickburn, the Gang Pioneer, and I'm here today to um, give you a review of Expeditions. Um, I'm sorry I've, I've, that the channel has been on hiatus for so long. I have been ill and have not had the energy to actually uh, set, you know, set this up and get it reviewed properly and the whole thing. Um, uh, at some point, I uh, hope to restart the channel, but I'm not sure when. Also, uh, I decided to grow my hair out, and so this is a wig. Uh, while I'm going it out because right now my hair looks like shit, okay? So, all right, at any rate, this is Expeditions by Stonemeyer Games. And since this review is months after the release of Expeditions, there are many videos out there explaining how the game is played. So I'm going to go straight to the re review. Okay, so this is supposed to be, you know, a, I don't know, a sequel to Scythe. This is not Scythe at all, in my opinion. It doesn't even seem like it's much related to Scythe. Well, it's got dull colors. Well, hell, I mean, come on. Really? Yeah. So, you know, the, the side tension that so many people enjoy, we did not find in this game, and that was a disappointment. Um, some like the artwork, I mean, it, it, well, you know, it's still my game. It's going to have a great artwork and, uh, il and illustration. Um, but frankly, I got tired of looking at all the gray-blue. It just wasn't appealing, you know? So, the exploration component. Oh, look, I'm going to turn over this new X. Woo. Um, you know, it just didn't take. It just, for us, there just wasn't an, an much anticipation as to what was going to come up. Moving the cards back and forth did take some thought, and there was certainly a strategic aspect to it, but again, we didn't engage with it much, because it seemed more like, you know, I uh, can't think of the word, but basically like they're just doing stuff. It didn't feel organic. Um, and they're really, you know, uh, it just felt kind of tedious. So, I will say this, unlike so many midway hobby games, it's very accessible, very. I mean, the whole, the box is great, everything in the box is great, you can see what you want to do. The rules, in my opinion, were very clear, you knew, you know, okay, well, we're supposed to do this, okay, great. Did not need a video teach, which I normally do. So I have to give them big ups on that. And, you know, if the the theme and the art appeals to you, it's not a bad thing. Okay, I'm not trying to say, oh, it's, you know, it's really, it's super terrible. The game is not super terrible. It's not even bad. It's just, you know, given all of the games that I own, um, it just, we played it a couple of times. I'll, you know, I'll be clear on, on, on that. And it just never made it back to the table. So, um, also, you know, I wasn't a fan of Scythe. That, you know, I, uh, I did uh, an earlier re review of the game. And neither were any of the other players in particular. So maybe, you know, the game just wasn't made for us. So, you know, look at up more reviews than mine. But uh, this, this is just kind of, you know, we're pretty flat for us. So thank you for watching and do have a great week.